CCR, College Career Readiness, is a great way for students to invest in themselves and their futures by figuring out something they're passionate about. It gives you opportunities you wouldn't get otherwise in a way that you could not imagine. It's a great way to really unlock your truest potential for now and your future. CCR stands for College and Career Readiness, and those are the courses here at Mercer Island High School and at Islander Middle School that are content-based but also have an application and skills uh, experience for our students. They're wonderful courses for our students because they provide the why. Why is this subject area is important? How is this applied out in the world? I think the hallmark of this course is uh, students become entrepreneurs in my class. You know, they're not just journalists, but they're also out there looking for stories. They're learning the, the skills that they need to learn so that they can be effective in their job. And oftentimes that's something that they are learning for the first time. And in my mind, that's great preparation for life after high school and college, where you just have to keep learning and keep applying and growing. I sort of always knew I wanted to do something with English, uh, but journalism is sort of the first thing that like really grabbed my attention. Um, and in the communication skills, more than anything, that it's taught me, like connecting to people, um, it sort of is the course that brought me out of my shell more than anything. Um, and also just being able to work in a team, especially when uh, there was a lot of different opinions and voices that we had to take into account in order to produce something we were proud of. My absolute favorite part about teaching this course is hearing students discover their voices and to understand that their words have power and that what they have to say is meaningful and part of a larger conversation, not only about the school community, but the local community or wider, that their voices matter. And that part that we've been exploring is this guitar riff. I actually produce my own music outside of this course. So a lot of the musical ideas, as well as the more like business-based ideas, like getting in touch with artists and making those connections, I've used a bunch. Right, so E, D, D. I think my favorite part about teaching uh, this class is that students really get to, like I said, express themselves and come up with new and creative ways to use sound to uh, show off both the types of music that they like and the types of music that they hope to create. What's most valuable to me about this class is just how open-ended it is. Uh, we're allowed to make our own projects, so we get to set our own goals and then work to complete them. I hope that every student leaves with uh, and inspiration and the skills and tools that they need to create their own music. Hopefully they're creating music that they enjoy uh, long after they've left the class. International Entrepreneurship is our capstone class for our business and marketing pathway. It is an opportunity for our students who have taken all of the other business classes, marketing, intro marketing, business law, AP Econ, to take that knowledge and apply it. Outside of school, what, what I use from this course is the communication skills that we've developed through either emails or phone calls, and even in-person meetings. What we learn in this classroom really applies to the real world. What we do is we create a student-run company, Mercer Trade Inc., and our students in that class get to run this company. The most valuable thing about this class to me is the community that we've created. Um, it's nice to know that at the end of the day you can come to uh, our, our classroom and be surrounded by people who want to make the company a better place and make our community a better place. It's about as real world as it can get and they walk away with that hopefully with an understanding of what it means to be a business person, what it means to be an entrepreneur. I'm looking to become an engineer in my future and this has really taught me a lot about engineering, using robotics, learning VEX, um, and just being able to understand designs that work um, well. My favorite part about teaching this course is that it's not a traditional class, it's very hands-on. So the students kind of get an end goal and they get the challenge and then it's just their job to figure out how to get there and I just kind of help them along the way. It's a fun class, um, it's a pretty nice escape from all the difficult, harder classes and I've learned a lot about engineering and programming using it. So one thing I like to teach the students is if they're going to, you know, attempt something, don't be afraid to fail. I think that's kind of a really important lesson because not all kids are going to go into robotics, but that's something that they can take with them everywhere. And if they're going to fail, fail big. Like if you have an idea, you don't know if it's going to work, try it anyway. So what is a COVID-19 molecular test? 
In this course, Biotechnology Research and Ethics, we prepare students for the future by giving them biotechnology skills. Um, they learn really about what's going on in the world. So for example, we're learning about um, COVID-19 and how the tests work and the vaccines. And I feel like this is the course where we can just really dive in to certain topics. I took AP Psychology as a way to explore my interest in psychology for a potential future career path. After falling in love with that, I realized that I want to do hopefully psychological research as I go through college and maybe even further than you know grad school and as a profession and biotech is a way for me to explore that interest because it's so heavily focused on research and that process I wanted to combine my two interests to see if that's right for me in the future. Well, I recommend a CCR course to everyone. Um, it's an environment where you can fail, make mistakes and learn from them and it's a great place to figure out what you're interested in and something that excites you every day. And it's a great way to figure out what you could do in the future in an environment where you're not taxed for it. So yeah, thank you for watching.